we go. That looks right. Now we're in business. But it's obviously not Zelda 2, so... Give me a second. I kinda hope for a second that there will be, like, Zelda 2 for the Genesis. I'm sorry. Burst your bubble. I'm sure someone's tried to do some kind of weird port to the Genesis of a Zelda game. Yeah, I mean, that will definitely be a good... Uh... Oh, no! I hope yes. it's not what I think it is! Oh, no, I think I know which game this is. No! <laughs> Fuck! We're back in boxing limbo! You don't like boxing? <laughs> well, I like boxing like the Punch-Out style, but I don't like boxing the Chavez style. Chavez is here. It's not even in English, let's do it. Jogadore. Yeah. Your Jugador one. Who do we like? Ooh, I like Zarati. He's pretty good. All right. Well, is there any way to know their stats or? Uh, uh you here pick they them. Are. Do it. Pick him. Barba? Does Select. that mean their beard? Their beard power? Damn it! That's Fox. There we go. It should mean uh, Zarate weird. versus Rodrigo. <laughs> oh shit, Pepsi and Pizza Hut, nice. Yeah. <laughs> that is some vintage Pepsi right there. Shots, Mike, you're getting tired. Your fist is disappearing. Yeah, your fist is kind of just disappearing in the void. Break it up. They come out boxing. He kind of looks like a very fit version of Steve Harvey. Got a smile on my face this whole time here. Got to break through. His guard is un unbeatable. That fist looks really awful. Damn. He's really giving it to me here. Oh, my fist is melted, completely gone. Uh, oh god, yeah, no, no more fist. This is still better than the last boxing game I saw someone play, which was... What was it called again? It was on the Sega CD. Why is... Is it like one of those FMV games or something? Yes, or yes it was. You cannot just end up punching and it doesn't even seem like it's affecting the movie whatsoever. It was Prize Fighter, that was the game. I'm not doing uh, any yeah, damage. That's about right. The game was great because it was FMV and also had like a really stupid plot where it was like, yeah, this kid is disabled and he wants you to win and then some other guy's like no lose so you get a ton of money <laughs> no damage at all right at the very least survive this round i've clocked him in the face like 300 times but it's, he's still 100 percent health and i'm dying maybe you gotta go for the gut yeah He's it's hard to tell if it's doing anything or uh, not. Oh god. Watch out, you're about to go down. Yeah, it's nonsense too. He's auto healing though. Like I've seen I've knocked him down once to like 90% and he just heals back up. He's got all those. Wait, first so he's got a hits. Pepsi IV hooked up to one of his boxing gloves. I'm healing too. Like it's yeah, just... just you got punched in the face so hard. Yeah, what the hell? He just kind of loses the punch a the head four chunk. times and he lost like maybe uh, a few tiny pixels of health. It's baffling is what it is. Compared to punch out, this is so much harder to figure out what the oh, fuck is no. happening. We'll be alright. We're tough. I like how that guy doesn't even have legs. They're cut off. Ah. Nothing special there. Deribus. 
Wait, I thought that the SNES version of this game had like ring girls or something. And don't ask me and don't ask me why I remember that kind of S N D thing. I think we gotta get like combos or it doesn't do any damage, that's what I think. And he's doing his combo and I have no idea how to do a combo of any kind. That game kind of seems like it's a bottom masher uh, express. Oh, yes. definitely. Right, well done, you're punching his arm. He's not taking any damage at all. Like, is there other places you can punch or something? Because I don't know. God, what's well, crazy? I understand. That's why we're gonna move on to Cheese Cat. Astrophy. <laughs> oh, hooray! Oh, this game. Wait, 1995? It took that long to make a game about this character? Yeah. Of course. That's some really smooth animation. Yeah. Got a problem with this plot, I guess. <laughs> Find me some carrots, dog. Doc, that makes me. I was yep. really confused. Hey, what's up, Why dog? Throwing 90s lingo at me. Oh, I think I remember which specific lo Looney Tune game this is. Or am I thinking of the other Speedy Gonzales one? I think I made people play this on my thing once. I'm, a monster. No, I'm thinking of the other one. Whoa! How does this help us solve our problem of catnapping? Well, you see, we're currently just, well, you know, kind of just wandering all over the place, and hopefully we'll find out the uh, Sylvester the cat. Oh uh, my, uh, ooh, there's a pit. Oh no, you were supposed to fall down there, apparently. It's a good pit. Like this round pit. Yeah. Why am I slow? What happened? Fuck. You Stop. got some kind of like sticky thing from the spiders. Oh man. It's one really game awful. with boxing gloves to another. Yeah, I love them. <laughs> Boxing's my favorite sport, I watch it all the time. I could name all kinds of boxers. Like the ones from 50 years ago, and that's it. <laughs> I can name about Butterbean, and I think that's it. Got that bird. Oh, there's Hippity Hoppity. That's his name. I remember. Bam. Hope we don't need, uh, hats or anything. Nah, you don't need hats. Who needs hats? Hope we don't need peppers. Hope this isn't a Defeat All Peppers video game, like that other one was. It is. There's something wrong here. We're not done yet. Maybe you have to fall down another hole? Yeah, maybe. There was another pit, I think, so maybe that's where you have to go. There's, like, no indication, though, that you could fall down those holes and be safe. We're going down. Hippity Hoppity is Sylvester's like son, his whiny kid. And a bunch of that's who that was. They never really it say is. his name because he's got a really stupid ass name, but that's what his name is. Hey, you're free. We have to find all the mice and save them all. We got work. To uh, yeah, do. it's probably save the entire family. 
Great. But I thought that only one person got kidnap or mouse snap or catnap. You're right. But they have to extend the gameplay somehow. Ugh. Oh shit! Oh, no. I maybe can't that go up there. maybe that was the one and only person you had to save because I don't think there was other pits you could fall in. Yeah, yeah I, I feel like I try to pretty well, I think. Um, if Tweety Bird pisses you off, then you should know it's a. It was a popular com comic who his gimmick was pretty much what Tweety Bird is, and now you don't know his name, but you know Tweety Bird. That's what happens when you're a one note comic. I guess you just you become a cartoon character and nobody remembers you. Uh, I guess That's there's something it. else. We've died. He should at least give you some indication of, hey, you're missing this many people, or... No, yeah, it's you're... not even written on the HUD anywhere. But hey, we sure got a lot of pepper points. There's another one. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> what a beautiful pit. Well, where the hell are the other ones then? You have to bounce off these enemies to go over these boxes, by the way. It's too tall of a box pile. If you don't jump off of them, you won't make it. This pit sucks, it's actually a level and not just a free kill. Free dude rescue. Is there anything else in this place? I think it's about it. Hmm. I'm more interested in the fact that they thought it was a good idea to make two Speedy Gonzalez games. Unless there's a third one I'm also forgetting. There's Roadrunner games, too. There are. Isn't there yeah. one on the PS1? They don't belong in this world. There's nothing down this pit. Well, shit. <laughs> How do we beat stage one? Oh well, no, what was that? these two were the only ones you needed. You know what would be really mean is if it turned oh. out... Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, well at least I can kind of see that there's pits covering some of them now. Oh, you're back at the bad place. No, we ain't doing that. Okay, what's this? I'm out of weaponry to break these, so... It's amazing, he can go so fast that he could just, you know, fly around... Yeah, see, there's another pit right here. That's pretty well hidden, though. I don't have any weapons. Yeah, there's pits under all of these boxes. Oh, no, it seems like we're never gonna figure out where her family is. Oh, no. That's not a, that's not a good one. How about this one? Yeah, thanks for the sub, Real Dragon. You're oh my the god, they actually did that. Fuck Bro, you, That's game. so rude. Well, is that everyone, do you think? Well, I'm pretty sure that's the life counter in the top right, but for some reason I feel like this game is so bad, that's actually how many are in the stage total. At least... I'm kind of getting that impression now, even though I'm almost positive it's the life counter. It is yeah, it's a life counter. counter. There's okay, an arrow good. now. What? Oh, oh, okay. New area? It's bonus round. Is that I what think? this is? No, um, I think that's level two, maybe? I'm well, sure there's a lot game, of peppers. This game has been gonged. I don't care what it is. Fuck this. Yep, we're dead. All right. Goodbye, Speedy Gonzalez. Have uh, good luck rescuing your family, I guess.
Data East made a video game called Chelnov. Let's try it out. It's not translated. Uh oh. Hell yeah. <laughs> the robotic Karnov. I mean, I kind of like this game so far. At least from the title screen. You know what, let's try and watch the intro. Obviously not reading it, but... Might get some cool art or something. Is it Atomic Runner? Good, we'll play it again. Look a little familiar. Yeah, I played this. Oh, I think I have seen this game before, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. <Nope. laughs> <laughs> They're sneaking up on me. Okay, so now it's a game where you walk forward, but so now it's a noto scroller? Yes. We can swap directions whenever we want. Ah, I've been blasted. out of my face where the gun upgrades there we go we get the boomerangs some of these projectiles seem like they're even tinier than your basic gun oh these suckers My face. We're not allowed to move backwards whatsoever, by the way. It's forward or stalled, and that's it. Those are our two options. Right, I found the plot. You take the role of Chelnov, a coal miner who miraculously survived a malfunction and explosion of a nuclear power, power plant. Your body gains superhuman abilities due to the massive amount of radiation given off by the explosion, and a secret organization seeks to harness those abilities for evil. That's pretty basic plot, honestly. Yeah, did they really need that many characters earlier to showcase this? And somehow, I did not get the impression that there was an explosive nuclear accident or whatever. Judging by the intro, all we saw was like two people standing on a table, uh, Facing each other, and that's Damn, about look all. At those. Well, Man, I guess weapon. the idea is it's supposed to be like Chernobyl, which would make sense because Atomic Runner. My orbs. Looks like you just picked up Nightman's weapon. You're screwed. It's Triple Nightman. Hell yeah. We're quick man. Yeah, quick boomerang, nice. Fire Those time. Those are even quicker than they normally are. I'll stick with these, I think. Yeah, Piro definitely got a whole lot weirder. I have to say, I definitely enjoyed the scenic sight of a uh, pyramid oh, stuck that's... over a giant. Uh, oh. <laughs> that's a big. I didn't even try to jump because I slid off, but I don't think I can jump that far. I don't think you can. I was trying to figure out what, it, what the hell I was supposed to do. There's oh. probably a run button. 
Gotta do something. Uh, nope. No. Oh. Let's uh, let's back it up and try again here. Is that, can you jump off these? Yeah. Think you can. All right, they're not actually armful at all. They're, they're mandatory. Yeah, they don't okay. make that very clear at all. Yeah, nah, that nah, was kind of a dick move, Kay. I was blowing them up. They look like enemies. Yeah, I mean, earlier they were enemies when this one other thing just surged in while being uh, surrounded oh, by all of the... Oh my goodness! <laughs> That's a pretty great sprite. <laughs> all right. Atomic Runner, stage one. Well, since I did this already... Probably we'll move on now that we beat a stage. Pretty goofy and uh, that stage though. I, I remember this map. What was unlicensed chess all about? Chess. chess. I know chess. Oh boy, 1998. Definitely what the Genesis missed and all of it the time where it was still going. Sega, Sega. Oh yeah, AI are in a time, buddy. All right. Oh, it's called oh, Master yes. Mode. 3D chess. Give me that Hell stuff. Oh yeah, 3D chess. Full, full medium, please. Go. Mm, that's chess, maybe. All right. Yeah. Look at those pawns. Oh my god. This is a very spart Spartan kind of design here, my god. This is the fastest game of chess I think I've ever seen. Oh, hold on, having a pause, having a thunk. What, oh, they're thinking. I guess this must be like Minnesota Fats where they have to load, so it makes it look like they're thinking. For a long time. So, uh... Uh... Hmm. Let me force you to go, you bastard. Pieces. Hmm. He did his move. Oh my god. <laughs> I can force them to move, apparently. Ah, uh, okay. Going all right? How you doing? The power of blast processing, folks. There's a lot to think about here. Oh, I can customize. Oh, what does that mean? Customize? Customize what? Wait, so you can just create like a random uh, chess scenario or something? No pawns. I think chess is a better game without them. Get them out of here. They suck. Should have it only be kings. You know what? Have some of these. Can you put more than one of the special units or no? Have some bishops or uh, have some of these suckers. You know what? Two queens over here, right? You just... There you go. Let's <laughs> oh <my> do it. <laughs> Now, now I'll start. Begin the match. Now, I'll st let's do it. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, maybe you have to push the go button like in the UI stuff. I'm gonna give him a new match. It's at 20 seconds that they forget how to play. For some reason, I'm not allowed to interrupt them after that. They know what move to make, they just don't want to make it, those bastards. Yep. Artificial thinking. Yeah, th this is awful. <laughs> My god. It's real bad. 
And I'm only allowed to interrupt them like on the frame that the second changes. I figured it out. So it's like mm, right there and it's just like it won't open up otherwise. Yeah, I'm sorry, uh, Genesis Chess, you are no battle chess. There's a NES chess game called Chess Master or something that has everything that this game has and does it right. Like customization and shit. Like it's already been beaten ten years ago. <laughs> Come on now, it's it's over. This game has clearly got its winner, right? Like I can easily see who's got this and it's still take on both sides take that long. I wanna see the end. They're gonna see if there's an ending screen, right? You think there's an animation? No, probably not. No. It's just gonna be like red or white wins. No, it probably won't even be that. It'll just be like, you win. But yeah, that's not even like animation. That's just the fucking chess piece just <laughs> being dragged to another piece. That's not animation. God, hurry up. They're oh almost done, I swear. Seems like a bad move there, that one. You think they're gonna draw? Uh, a rook for a rook. Yeah, that's not good. They could finish it now, I think. Like, I love the sound of the soundtrack constantly restarting. I gotta hurry them along, we gotta see our move here. What? Hmm. So we got uh, a bishop and a rook and three pawns versus five pawns and a rook, and that's what's left. They're working on it. Oh my. Wait. We're getting there. Why doesn't he kill the- What the fuck is happening? Does the AI of this game knows how to play chess? It's level 12 inverse of, uh, of skill? <laughs> Maybe? I think it's like the Gandhi nuke value, where it just kind of overflowed. So they actually don't know how to play chess now. Damn. How many things for the Because this game could have been finished like over 20 fucking turns ago. They haven't done anything. We lost one pawn in 10 years. They're about to let them get another queen. Look, I guess that's three. gonna end the game, right? No. <laughs> that fucking pawn is useless. Send him in! Hey! My god! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> what is this? Okay, is the game over or no? No. What the fuck? <laughs> <They're>... ah! <laughs> I'm gonna fast forward and see if they ever move on their own here. They won't. I don't think they will, you're right. Give them a minute. 340. 350. 4. 410. 20. 30. Or 40. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they just freeze. Just, but I'm just wondering if by rushing the remove, they somehow don't think about the thing. But come on, it's not as if there's a lot to think about here. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. I'm mashing buttons now to get this to go as quickly as it allows humans to interact with it. It's four versus four. Please, someone just take the pieces already. Man, chess sure sucks. Ba -da -ba -ba. Wait, the timer? The timer for the game? Yeah, the timer rolled back. They've gotten their time back. They they earned it. 
Well then, by that logic, they should be able to play normally. You... I give up on chess, I'm sorry. Chess lovers, but... <laughs> I think I have a new idea for her. Need our marathon. <laughs> Just a cheetah. Oh, no. Oh, no, not this no! one. Why, hello there, Flava Flav. Hippo. You guys remember all these uh, Chester Cheetah buddies, right? I love that one of the buttons is X. It's useless. Yep. Nothing! I think this also came out on the Super Nintendo. Maybe. I wonder if it's the same game or if it's something different. In fact, yeah, it did, because I think I saw my buddy play this recently on Super Nintendo for some reason. Oh, this might actually know. This might actually be the game in question. Oh, yeah, it is. So they just they were like, well, we have extra buttons on the Genesis. What do we do? Nothing. Let's have to customize it. Well, to be fair, it's not as if the Super Nintendo game used more than two buttons anyway. So. That's also true. See, now here's what I would have done if you have extra buttons and you need an attack. Just have them throw like Cheeto dust. Dash. Oh, shit. Do they even sell the paw prints anymore in Cheeto form? Um, yeah, they do. I don't think I ever see them anywhere here. There's one right there. The thing I, the thing I always see is the build a skeleton Cheetos. Which is the best one, of course. Do we need those? Or are they coins? Uh, no, I think these just gives you a... Yeah. yeah, what you have to do is to find, uh, I think, like, the tires of your motorcycle or something <laughs> like that. <laughs> Hold on. Don't... <laughs> 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 You're uh, trying to, like, I think you're, this takes place in, like, a park, and the park ranger and his dog are after you for some reason. Makes sense. Got the, the glasses on here. Oh, now instead of darkening the screen, they make the game in black and white. Oh, they wore off. Yep, there we go. The tire. Yeah, the sunglasses is definitely a power up that. Yeah, it allows existed. you to see things that you will not normally be able to see. You see, it. It's really just you have to be cool enough to be able to see them. So you know, if you have a pair of sunglasses, you're much cooler, and you can see them. That's how it works. Makes sense. Ugh. Here's a boss. Good job. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm not. I'm dead. Actually, damn. Let me. Let me. Voicemail here. <laughs> Am I buzzing in on this? Hold on a second. Does that say Craig it? That's not a D. Yeah, Craig it five. Oh no, we lost all of our five crickets.
All right, uh, parents' car broke down. I gotta go pick them up. I'll be back in an hour to do Donkey Kong Country 2. That's my situation. So I gotta uh -oh. cut my broadcast. I hope for... everything's okay. Well, the, the cars broke down. That's all. I just gotta go pick them up. So I will be back later with that show at midnight, probably or eleven. I don't know. I'll definitely be on later, though. I'll see you then. Thanks for coming right. by. In the meantime, folks. I figured that was a voicemail that I needed to get because <laughs> it was like my parents so easily leave me voicemail. All right, I'll see you later, folks. Yeah. I'll definitely be back on. Who's, who's on? We got a host in the meantime here. I'll throw you at Sky Bills, playing Magic Arena. See you later. Literally later, like uh, real soon. If you're interested in Donkey Kong sounding bad.